गुडविल वेन अ पार्टनर रिटायर्स ही विल नो लॉन्गर गेट द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ द फ्यूचर प्रॉफिट्स ऑफ द पार्टनरशिप फॉर he has helped to build the goodwill which is not reflected in the balance sheet like we mentioned before if partner c retires today and day after if the business was to be liquidated the partnership firm would receive some money towards goodwill too which is not there in the balance sheet the retiring partner should actually have a share in this amount of goodwill so when a partner retires his share of goodwill is credited to his account his share of goodwill may have to be valued up to that date and his share in that goodwill is credited to his account let us consider a couple of examples if we credit the retiring partner's capital account what do we debit we debit the remaining partners we debit the gaining partner's capital accounts in their gaining ratio gaining partner's capital accounts in their gaining ratio let's take an example a b and c are equal partners a retires goodwill is valued at 3 lakh does not appear in the balance sheet what is the entry for goodwill adjustment who retires a retires what is his share of goodwill 1/3 of 3 lakh a's share of goodwill is equal to 1/3 of 3 lakh equal to 1 lakh right so this amount needs to be credited to a's account since a is retiring what are the accounts which would be debited b and c's accounts would be debited what is their gaining ratio the ratio between them is the same it was equal before it is equal now therefore they will also bear this equally therefore the entry will be b's account b's capital account debit c's capital account debit two retiring partner that is a's capital amount which will go to a's capital is a's share of goodwill which is 1 lakh and b and c will bear this equally or 50000 50000 this would be the accounting entry for adjustment of goodwill on retirement of the partner another example a b and c are partners share profits equally A retires. Goodwill appearing in the books is three lakh. Appearing in the books at rupees three lakh is actually valued at six lakh. A will get credit of. What are the options here? A two lakhs, B three lakh, C fifty thousand, and D one lakh. Goodwill is already appearing in the books. An amount of goodwill, if it appears in the goods, that. amount is already reflected in the capital accounts of the partners as is the value of all the assets and liabilities which are already existing in the balance sheet so we don't need to pass any adjustment entry with respect to this 3 lakh however it is valued at 6 lakh which means there is an amount of 3 lakh which is not reflected in the balance sheet what is a's share in that a's share in that is 1/3 of 3 lakh which is 3 lakh 6 lakh minus 3 lakh that is equal to 1 lakh so a will get a credit of 1 lakh a will get a credit of rupees 1 lakh and b and c's accounts would be debited with 50000 and 50000 each <coughs> 50000 each okay 